everyone's here to see me. <laughs> I prepared a speech. <laughs> My name is Erica Burns. I am six foot one. My weight changes every day. I have brown eyes and long curly brown hair that, without a generous amount of Moroccan oil, is as frizzy, dry, and rough to the touch as my pubic hair. <laughs> percent sober right now because I can never resist a bloom of goobies when I come here. I will be sure to watch mom when it comes on demand as my weekly reminder for why not to become an alcoholic. Today I am going to talk with all of you about my recent journey from hatred to love. <laughs> Before now, there was nothing more I hated in the world than Taylor Swift. I loathed the bitch with a passion. I discovered Taylor Swift in 2007, when my cousin was over watching her music videos on Music Choice, alternating between teardrops in my guitar and Picture to Burn, over and over and over and over again, all weekend long, literally. All fucking weekend long. <laughs> By Sunday afternoon, I was ready to burn down the house, thus setting a raging fire that could have only been extinguished by the teardrops dripping from my face. Teardrops of joy over no longer having to hear that annoying fucking voice. Years went by of me continuing to revel in my hatred of the country pop princess. It wasn't until 1989 that I started to ask myself if I was being too hard on the girl. And then, just last month, I took a Facebook test to determine what song was written with me in mind. <laughs> you know what I got? I'm about to tell you. <laughs> giving a speech. It'd be nice if you could please be respectful. <laughs> I got Taylor Swift's Shake It Off. It couldn't have been. All the time I'd spent hating her, she was all the while writing a song just for me. How could it have been so blind? All those years I'd spent unhappy and hateful when there was such love right in front of me. Every time I turned on the TV, logged onto the internet, listened to the radio, picked up a magazine, you name it, Taylor Swift was everywhere. She was the omnipresent goddess I'd been in search of all along. <laughs> Excuse me. Conclude, we must all learn 
how to love and not be a killer. Thank you.